In this video, we will show you how to find the measurements for a round glass watch crystal so you know what size to look for if you have to order a replacement. Whether or not you currently have your old crystal, this video will show you how to get the right measurement. The only tools you'll need for this are a measuring gauge and a cleaning cloth. The first thing you'll need to do is remove the existing crystal from your watch. For a step-by-step -step guide, check out our how-to video on removing watch crystals. If you already have a crystal on hand, the process is simple. Just measure the diameter of the crystal to obtain the proper size. Measure in two to three places to confirm the size and round your measurement to the nearest one-tenth of a millimeter. If the crystal is broken or missing, you can measure the inside of the bezel. You will need a caliper with an inside measuring jaw to do this. There's a step ledge at the bottom of the bezel where the crystal and gasket will sit. The inside of the wall above this ledge is what you will measure. Insert the caliper into the step and take the measurement in two or three different places to get the most accurate measurement. Be sure to round to the nearest one-tenth of a millimeter. When ordering crystals to fit a gasket, order a size that's one-tenth of a millimeter larger than the gasket measurement in order to get the proper fit. In this case, since the gasket measurement was 29.4 millimeters, you would order a round crystal with a diameter of 29.5 millimeters. It's important to note that round crystals come in a number of different styles. If you have the original crystal, you can easily match up the style. But if the crystal is missing, you can choose from our selection of thin, thick, domed, and magnifier glass crystals. The thickness of the crystal can be measured using your caliper. Once you have the right measurement, you can order your replacement crystal at esslinger.com. Most crystals come in 0.1 millimeter increment sizes, but some styles only come in 0.5 millimeter increments. To learn more about watch repair or how to replace your own watch crystal, check out other videos on our YouTube channel.